Hi, everybody. It's Wednesday, and that means it's card making and scrapbooking morning here in the Tarpon Room. And I'm here with Kay Goodchild of Periwinkle. And Kay is going to show us a little bit about how everyone can get started if somebody hasn't tried this kind of thing before. What do you need to do, Kay? All you need to do the first time is to bring some pictures, and we will get you started with that. And then if you like it, you can pick up supplies as you need them, and we sometimes have some to loan. And this is basically the basic of what we use for scrapbooking, all of which we can help you use the first time you're here and maybe some after that. So it looks like you have some scissors and a ruler, a cutter, some pretty basic things. And special scissors that cut oh, okay. kind of weird but cute. The fancy scissors that make a, a cool border. Right. All kinds of fun. Oh, there's probably all kinds of fun things you can right. and add to your kit. When that's you correct. Home. And this is 12 by 12 paper for a 12 by 12 album. And right next to it is the eight and a half by 11 paper. Mm -hmm. And some of the uh, different things we use, we use uh, fancy uh, papers mm -hmm. and we use solid papers and they kind of go together. Some, uh, what do you call this, clip art? Yes. So there's things like that that you can get all kinds of little goodies. I know you can get little things you can glue on, right? Right, and we have all kinds of punches, all mm -hmm. kinds of the fancy scissors, and we share. Sure. And so you can come in and use most of our stuff. Well, why don't we go talk to some of the other ladies and see what they're up to. This is when uh, I went to Italy and Sicily with my husband. You got a little Pinocchio going on yes, there? Yes, yes, very important. Sure, you got to have Pinocchio. And then the memory keeper memories when I went on cruises. Mm -hmm. And this is probably uh, the most important of all. It's about the World Trade Center, mm. the first bombing when I was in and it. And you were there yes. in your class. Right? And all the publicity and all the things we did. And the children, it looked like they were doing very well. The media loved us. I have to say and that. you were stuck in an elevator, elevator, is that correct? For six and a half hours. With how many kids? Uh, 19. 19 kids and, and Anna Marie in the elevator. Mm. On the 36th floor. Oh. So we were eventually... Um, rescued by the firemen mm. and we didn't know what happened so oh. that was good the children were wonderful they really were a great way to document it and, and it was it took all these years mm -hmm. it really did it took and now till here it all together last, yes great idea yes and here we have Colleen Curry from Cameo Colleen show us what you have so my parents and when my sister and I and I'm going to be ha I'm going to be uh, writing uh, memoirs along with the this is my great granddaughter my before I moved just before I moved here this is my great granddaughter so you're getting yourself all organized here yeah, and, and then gonna you're gonna be, put it all into I've a got book over 10,000 pages right now and I'm trying to bring it down to about 400 whoa and it's gonna be at about the 60s 70s and 80s and it's gonna this was our first our first uh, chair this was our uh, fr family furniture in our living room, this was a living room that we first li uh, lived in. When in I was the inflatable here. living room. And then coming to Shell Point, of course, and being in Shell Point. And by the way, the first thing I get up in the morning, the first thing I do every day is turn on SPTV, Ch Channel 11. Thank you. Linda Graham from Sundial has some lovely creations here. Show us what you've done here, Linda. Well, you can start out with very simple cards where you layer them and you stamp them. You can go to embossing and then you go into what's called techniques. Uh -huh. And a technique Look at this. would be, this is a wiper card. Mm -hmm. Look at that. How clever. Then it stands freestanding. This here is called a card in a box. Card in a box. Look at that. Lays flat and then it pops up. How fun. So you have taken stuff way, 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 way down the pike here. So something yes. you can do something very, very simple mm -hmm. or something really complex like that. Very artful. Yes. Very nice. I have uh, a fairly new resident, Joyce Schaefer. She, she heard about the class fairly recently. Yes, right. And tell us, you're a beginner at this? I'm just a beginner. I'm not doing these fancy mm -hmm. ones, but I'm trying to learn. Well, it's looking and great so far. It's helped me a lot here, so I'm... Starting that, just learning. Very good. Now it's great fun. So you mentioned you you've traditionally bought a lot of cards. Yes, yes. So th I'm now I'm going to make them. So you can save money with this class. Well, also it's fun to do. Anybody can buy a card, but to make them is different. That's and right. And a lot of help here. So now do you put a little something in the back that says mm -hmm. made by made by yes, Joyce. Do. 
I did it. So when you send this to uh, a friend or a loved one, there we go. See, we have a little, a little identification and, and that you can. It's very important to do that. That's right. So I started. I didn't do it at first, but now I'm doing it. Perfect. Well, this is a scrapbook project here. A scrapbook. I just came back from a cruise. We went to Bermuda. Came back Saturday, so I'm working on that there. And this is when we went to Billy's Swamp Safari. Okay. And this is what we are doing there. This is a garden that we have. It's our inspirational garden. Mm -hmm. And one of the local artists drew oh, a picture. A painting of your garden. Yes. Oh, nice. And what's unique about this, and Yvonne Schneff did this. Did she? Oh. Yes. And this is a 3D birdhouse that's on it. And this is hanging on our wall now. Very so nice. So that's the way we did that. But that's 3D. Oh, lovely. And uh, I started this group two years ago just as I was moving here because they didn't have any scrapbooking. Mm -hmm. So I named two co-leaders, which was Debbie Melchie and Joy Ellen Ryan. And so one of us is always here. We have supplies in the back. And uh, come and try us out. If you want to bring your knitting, go ahead. We'll, we love to talk. We have a great time. Wednesday morning, right here in the tarpon room in the tunnel. Come on out and give it a try.